Hello there, once again, and as you can see, I've got my hands on a new little package of set boosters. So today is the official release day for Kamigawa Neon Dynasty, and yeah, I've just visited my local game store and got my hands on this little nice piece of cardboard. And yeah, let's see what's inside, what we can grab out of it, and get a look on this package. What's interesting, as far as I can see it right now, normally this uh, foil, uh, foil wrapping uh, has the results of the code sticker on top of it. So Neon Kamigawa seems to have switched that to the lower side. Also, I don't know why, for me this logo seems a little bit different than in other times. Don't know why. Uh, yeah, just something I've seen right now. Interesting. As you can see here, Wizards of the Coast. You go on. And yeah, we do have a package. Once again, like always, it's made in Belgium. Like the normal piece of packages that we can get. So it's the mid-tier of quality. Normally you won't see any problems with that. We do have it uh, with with this number as a serial number, so yeah, everything seems to be fine. And now, let's get to open it. Well, like always, with the trust your leather man. Wrapping goes on and on, like always. And yeah, we do have a Tamiyo in the pre-completed stage. Cool, nice piece of cardboard that we have here. Interesting, meet Kaito, the new planeswalker that we have. We do have our 30 packets, uh, packs, and we'll see what we can get out of it. So, first package. Unfortunately, no kind of box topper here, but we don't need it always. What do we have here? Yeah, we do have a little card, we do have some nice piece of planes. Cool card. Fang of Shigeki. We have a blade blue at Kitsune. Some real, real cool cards here. Mitsumi Parola. Ichiko's Reign of Truth. And the first re Oh! Really, 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 really nice pick. We do have Kura in foil. Nice, good pick. We do have the, right now, most expensive card of the set from the normal cards, a Boseu who endures. And the quality is also rather good. Only, I don't know if you can see it, it's like this out of the box. Uh, minimum crimping, so it's uh, the lower end of near mint, I'd say it's rather excellent. Uh, if you'd be strict, but... Yeah, really cool. So normally the, 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 the borders, they look clear and crisp, as you can see it here. And yeah, good, nice little pick. Here we have our nice little land here, the normal cards. And yeah, don't know, is there any other kind of rare spot? Don't know it right now. We'll just take it as, as it is. Package number two. And as always, I'll go from the top to the bottom in the left, middle and right spot in this piece of package. And let's go through with it. Nice little mountain. We do have our art card. There's one. These cards look stunning. Really like this kind of style. The anime style here. We have the Inkers Infiltrator, Kaito's Pursuit, Kappa Tech Rack, uh, Rapper, so the, our Ninja Turtle. Really cool card. Do have a spinning wheel kick, shattered star, another car, interesting, and a wanting emperor. Nice pick, two mythics right behind it, right behind each other. Put it over here. Cool cards, copper tech wrapper, uh, tech wrecker, cool cards. So I want it on a special place. Maybe let's see if we can get four of those, then we'll have to. Ninja Turtles together. Another little land. We do have 
uh, Boon of Paseo, Tales, the second land of the cycle. Really cool. Takeuma in the third card spot. Nice, nice, nice. I think I'll need to put these cards in a little bit of a different uh, setup for the mythics, for the rares, for the special lands, and for this little spirit that we have here. We do have Tetzeret as an art card, Scarred Barons, Moonsnare Specialist, cool cards, Short Circuit, Lethal Exploit. What do we? Get a reality heist, cool card. Cloud Steel Kirin and the Thunder Steel Colossus is a foil. Cool card. This one comes down here. Cloud Steel Kirin, you can't lose the game, the opponents can't win the game. So that's the white platinum angel, I think. And this as a reconfigure card. Cool little thing. You do have Jungle Hollow and Foil, Netsumi Blade Blesser. Those cards the artwork is really really stunning if you can see it here looks really really nice i think these in foil they'll be really cool Agents authority you have opika reckoner march of burgeoning life and the story weave as a foil interesting little pick but still this package is already uh, on the really, really good side with the first two mythics and the first lands that we've, uh, we've got here. So good Triangle Cove, Mutai Ambushar. <laughs> cool little, cool style. We have a high speed, we are born to drive. High speed hover bike. I'd like that in reality. A Ganjo Uprising, an Imperial Subdue, and an Invisible Stalker. A Ganjo Uprising, create to summarize. It only creates X minus one white samurai creatures. And not so useful, I think. But still, cool, cool cards. What can we get here? It seems another discard. Let's hope so. Not these pseudo mythic, uh, pseudolist cards. Of Imperial, crafted. And a hotshot mechanic. Cool card. Mechanic Mesh Hunger, Tales of Master Sishiro. Marsh of Swirling Mist, the Era of Enlightenment, and a modal list card. Swirling Mist will put us over here. We are on package number eight, number seven. So, 23 to go after this. Nice little pack. Oh! So, we do have our first foil. Japanese land from the land cycle. So quality wise always a, a little bit of dust on these cards, but yeah From the corners from the border that we have here They look sharp and crisp. So no issues here on the back sides. These cards are, li are a little bit uh, Yeah crimped out, but still looks very good so it's mid middle of near mint Cool card. What do we get? Netsumi Prowler, Moon Circuit Hacker, Tamiya Safekeeping. We want to get the land that's ah, to come with Transcendence. Sehr cool. Cool card. Put this up to the nice rares. So what we also want is the uh, unofficial successor of the Cavern of Souls, even if it's not as powerful. Still really, really nice. So let's see. Blossoming Sands. We've got Enganjo. Uncharted Heaven. Haven. Nice. Michiko's Reign of Truth. So we can switch it up to Portrait of Michiko. Teachings of the Kirin. And the Silver from Master. So move the cards, put a 1 1 counter, and switch over to Kirin Touched Orochi. Orochi. Cool card. Cool little pick. We'll put it down here. Portrait of Michiko. Cool card. Michiko Konda, if you want to really annoy commander players. Bloodfall Caves. 
Pierre Samurai, Shattered Sea. Oh, Goshin Tie of Life's Origin, nice. No tie and Invoke Despair. <laughs> and Red Colony, cool. <laughs> this package was nice. We, we've got an Invoke Despair in the anime style. In foil, also really, really cool. Put it over here on the side of the Muko Tiger. Muko Tiger Soul Ripper as a vehicle in black. Cool card. And a Goshen Tire of Life's Origin and, and third mythic that we've got of these packages. Cool pick. Cool, cool pick. Unfortunately, no Japanese style land. I really like this. This one will go directly to my Urza deck. Really like it. Oh, and, this, and another foil package. So, planes in foil. You can really see the, the, the reflection here, these small butterflies. And once again, you've got the crimp marks on the back side. So, so the front is stunning. The back uh, is still really good, but these crimpings or such, uh, yeah, seems to be normal, unfortunately. We have Master's Rebuke, Runaway Trash Bot. <laughs> trash Bot, fun. A big Reckoner, Follower Ishin, Two Heavens S1, and Michiko's Reign of Tooth. And a Call of Nightwing. Evil card. Real, really evil card. Put it over here. Invoke Despair. Yeah, from the old times, the Invoke Pretrapus. That still exists, that wants to be denied from Wizards. Uh, don't know if it's good or bad to deny your history. Defending the Moth, Inventing, Inventive Iteration, Moon Snare Specialist. Cool. Some of those sagas do really, really give a lot of possibilities for switch cards, for Turn the battlefield, I think. Oh, we do have the planes, uh, planeswalker stamp on it. As far as I know, I've read it yesterday. These cards do have the planeswalker stamp because the original uh, signature of the artist is simply way too big. <laughs> Interesting uh, reason, but yeah, don't understand why they didn't simply uh, shrink it down. But yeah, lucky offering, cool cat, like it. Tales of Master Sishiro, Mishikos, I think the third or fourth one. Me Mech Titan Core, cool card. And the Shrine Steward. The Core is also, I think, one of the better cards. Especially for the decks with many and more uh, vehicles. Yeah, it can grow, it can grow. And it can grow really fast. Cool card. Let's see what we do have next. Another Mich no, this is Michiko. Bearer of Memory. And a normal foil. But, to be honest, if you can see it like this, this foiling for these, I think, ghosts, it should be, uh, for this basic land, to be honest, it, it's stunning. It's really, really nice. Put it over here. You have a road table query, touch the spirit realm. Life of the Ch uh, Toshiro Mitsawa with his Yike. Invoke Calamity and Shiro Tai Genesis Engine as a foil and anchor to reality. So we've got an Invoke Calamity and we've got a fourth mythic of this package. Even if this mythic is from the commander row or from the commander game. And yeah, you can get these cards in here. As far as I know, you can also pick the commander cards as a first here in foil. Interestingly enough, Air of Ancient Fang, cool card. Colleges Terrarium, Thirst for Knowledge, Long Reach of Night, and oh, nice, Thundering Raiju. Spirit in the anime style, I think. Yeah. The area and the surface, yeah, it's it's a little bit mint, uh, uh, seamless, cool.
cool. Nice little pick. So in German, we, uh, there's the word uh, something is samtig. So if it's not just flat or uh, yeah, let's say when you grab something and it just doesn't. Uh, oh, reality chip. Nice card. And mindling mesh. Uh, yeah, nice mindling mesh. Like it here in foil. Cool card. As well as the reality chip. That's also real, really nice. And merging of blooming star add on one of the commander cards. But reality chip goes up here. Mindling mesh and merge in here and here. So what I wanted to say is uh, the surface, if it's not slippery, but can be grabbed rather good. Um, yeah, it's called Samtik, like the material Samt, so see. And yeah, cool Kami. Really many foils in here. Modern Age, Shokenzan, the third land of these, of the cycle. Cool pick. And yeah, so let's see if we can get the full cycle. What is missing is the blue one and the white one. And to be honest, I know everybody loves the green one because it's uh, a little bit of uh, Snake Ninja Death Touch. A little bit. And the next Kapatek Wrecker. Cool. So, Michelangelo and Donatello, we've got. Um, yeah, to be back. Many like the you know, Lion Sash, also a very, very good card. Um, but I think the one that saves your card, so that the blue land is still uh, the best of the five cycles. Because rather than destruction, I like to uh, save my cards in times where pretty much in all sets there are many and more exile cards, etc. He not at uncrowned. <laughs> nice. Okay. We've got him returned in memory. That's uh, interesting. In one package, we've got uh, the same card in both different uh, styles. And it's, yeah, it looks really, really nice. Number two, 222 and number 398. Nice pick. And if you see these cards here, so that's the normal style on the right and the anime style on the left. They look stunning. And I think this one in foil would be even more stunning. So cool pick. Cool thing. It worked. It worked rather well. And uh, one other thing. So these packages, these set boosters, here's the serial number also. Uh, they are pretty easy to crack, to be honest. So uh, if you've seen the video of the packs from the double feature, they are way harder the, uh, to crack than uh, these ones. Restoration of a Ganja with Architect of Restoration on the backside. Cool pick. Also good of quality. Um, yeah, so these foiling, the, 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 this uh, wrapping, is a little bit more instable than the other one. So still stable enough, so they won't get damaged through anything, but still easier to crack. So rather good. Fang of Shigeki, cool snake. Tamiya safekeeping. It's interesting, we have still haven't seen... Oh, Koda, Kua, another one. Another mythic. So we've got two Kuras. One in foil, one in normal. That's interesting. Yeah, they, they are really easy to crack. They are way more complicated packages. Fifth Water, we have Dokuchi Silencer, Yamazaki, cool card. Obika, Fable of the Mirror Breaker, nice. We've got Kiki Gigi as a reflection. So now Obika can get two of those. Cool pick. Pick, pick it up here. So, we've got uh, four, eight to go after this, as far as I know. So, let's see what we can crack. I still want the new Jingitaxis. 
friendly moth. So invoke despair once again, put it down here. But yeah, we've got three of the five cycle lands. So everything's good and well. But yeah, I still want a blue one. We've got the Emperor and another Japanese style land. Cool thing. Goshintai, Goshintai, another one. More Jin of Cryptic Dreams, Light Paw of Emperor's Voice. And a <laughs> nice Sun Titan. Cool. Still, once again, a little mythic package. We've got Light Paws, that's a really, really evil card to play with. And yeah, really, really like this. Mojin of Cryptic Dreams. Have to read it a little later. But Light Paws, if you play an Aura deck, that's really, really nice. It's an Aura Tutor, you can play through with everything. It's also really, really nice. Look on these small flowers here, I think. Flowers, flowers, or spirits, don't know, but I really like this style and foil. Air of Ancient Fang, Elgarja Exemplar, what we've got, Kitsune, Air of Enlightenment, Goro Go, the Disciple, Cool card. Creatures are gonna go in haste. Ah, that's the one for the dragons, nice. We can build a combo for dragons, I think. And this should work really well. So, Thornwood Falls, Mukotai Ambusher, Aki Aki, several Goshintais. Really nice, new shrines. Behold, and Kodam of the West Tree, nice! <laughs> so, this set has good many and more of the mythics, so this box was really, really practical. Let's see what we'll get else. Uh, swamp, very nice. Third cup attack wrapper, so we have Michelangelo, Leonardo, Donatello. Oh, here's a little courtyard, that's what I wanted. Put it down here. Tails, uh, Mojin the Rowing Blade, and a Farewell, nice. Farewell is a nice card. Mojin, don't know, have to read it later. But Mojin of Rowing enters the battlefield with an indestructible counter if it comes from your hand. Remove an indestructible counter. It deals 7 damage to each of up to 3 targets. Oh, that's evil. If you play, for example, with an Animar deck like I do, and you have uh, something like the double doubling season uh, in game, this one will put much and more damage out. Nice. Yeah, a little bit of a wood. Uh, Ancestral Katana, Gravelight, Shattered Era, a Ganjo, the fourth one. Let's hope we'll get the, the, the last one. We've got four of the five ones. Selfless Samurai and Windborn Muse. Creatures can't attack unless they control plus two. Oh, nice. Cool card. Like the ghostly prison. So, two to go. Let's hope for the last land. Let's really hope for it. We've got the forest, a little bit of wood there, brilliant restoration, Shigeki, and Arrow Bar. Go card, return all artifacts and enchantment cards to your grave yet, uh, from your grave to the battlefield. Nice card. If you play much and more white. And here we've got the last package. Hopefully with blue land inside it. The small backwater. Another blue land, I mean. <laughs> Tales of Master. Chishiro Shattered Blade. Invoke the Ancients. Mojin. And our shards. Also a nice little package. Even if we didn't get the fifth land. Have to get it somewhere else. But our shards. Nice card. Mojin Towering Might as a... For oh, that's what I meant. You can get the commander cards now in foil. So, nice pick. Invoke the Ancients. And Krishiro, another mythic, even it's, if it's a mythic from the commander deck. But yeah, you can get everything here. So, really, really 
really nice little picks so that you can see everything uh, once again. Put them up. What we've got as mythics from all these packages. Shishiro, Wild Boy Mew, the Kodama, Sun Titan, Kura number one, Shirogai, Goshintai, the Emperor, cool card, uh, Kura number two in foil, N land number one, farewell, light pass, the lion sash, really cool card, N land number two, reality chip, Kami, land number three, and land number four, really, really nice. Mojin and Foil, Mindling Mesh, Invoke Despair, Our Shots, I'm not aware, but a but cool card. Invoke, we've got Shigeki, Goro, Mojin of Cryptic Dreams, another Invoke, both Hinatas, another, another Mojin, don't know, Thundering Raiju in anime style, Mech Titan Core, another an Ishin, what we've got here, Teachings of the Kirin, Merge of Burning Life, and Cloud Steel Kirin. So really, really nice card. So I think this piece, uh, this package was worth it. Even if uh, also, if you see that we've got these little picks that you can play anytime. But really, really nice. So I hope you had fun to watch. Uh, give me some idea what's to, what's to be better. For example, here the, the lighting that came from the side um, yeah, have a good day, have a good time.